We have breaking news out of Fishers tonight where the police chief, Mitch Thompson, says he is stepping down from his job, but he would like to stay with the department. His resignation follows his arrest on Friday for allegedly driving drunk and causing a three-car crash. Our Rich and I spent this day in Fishers today and joins us now live. And Rich, what are we to make of this statement that's coming from Thompson? Well, Mitch Thompson says that he recognizes that he can no longer lead the Fishers Police Department with the headquarters right here behind me. He met with the mayor today and Thompson submitted his resignation. I would now ask Chief Kale to step forward and help Major Thompson with the retirement of his assistant chief's badge and the placement of his new chief's badge. Eyewitness News was there almost two years ago when Mitchell Thompson was proudly promoted to Fishers Police Chief. But Chief Thompson resigned today after Indianapolis police arrested him for drunk driving Friday night and causing a three-car accident near 96th and Keystone. Thompson registered .126 blood alcohol content on the breathalyzer test. In his resignation letter, Thompson said, I deeply regret having to take this action, but realize that stepping down as the chief executive officer of this department is an important first step in taking responsibility for my actions. The family of the 18-year-old female driver of the middle SUV in the accordion accident provided this photo of the scene. Only minor injuries despite the vehicle turning upside down. Thompson indicated he hopes to remain with the Fishers police. He wrote, I intend to fully cooperate in the departmental administrative investigation and look forward to continuing to serve the agency in whatever capacity the future may hold. And it's important to note again that this accident happened in Indianapolis and Thompson was arrested by IMPD. His initial court appearance, although no charges have been filed yet, is scheduled for August 16th. Anne-Marie and John.